Hey everybody, I Heart Movies here, and welcome back to Let's Play Wild Arms 2. We're back to the town of Marion because I want to do some preparations before heading off to our destinations, either the town of Holst or the Rayline Observatory. I'm not sure which one I'll go to yet. Both are profitable, so uh, we'll see. Yeah, we have seven personal skill points right now, and we definitely want to use them. Um, some good skills to get. Uh, restore HP is wonderful. Whenever your force goes up by 25% or by 25, 50, 75, 100, you gain HP, which is fantastic. Uh, up parameter is also really good. That'll raise your stats when your force level goes up. Um, other ones here. Critical is decent. Gives you a chance of critical hits. That's pretty, pretty good there. Uh, the attack and defense ones here are also really, really good for most everyone, really. Physical attack for, let's say, myself and Brad isn't as needed. Um, just like how um, it's not really needed for Lota either, she's a mage. Um, of physical defense is good for the entire team. Magic attack for myself and Brad is pointless. Magic defense for us too is pretty good. Status ailments? Um, you will want to get confusion and sleep down the road for optional boss fights there. The other ones, they're, they're, they're okay, they're easy to get, but they're not really worth it in my book. So what I want to do... Let's go for Restore HP, because that one's really, really good. To do a level of that for each person. And then with the other three, um, let's go Magic Defense for myself and Brandis. We have pretty low sorcery. Uh, Lilka doesn't have physical... Uh, can't do physical defense. That would be really, really helpful. Um, up Magic Attack would be nice right now, actually. It only takes three. But her spells are really powerful anyway, so actually I'll hold off on her points for right now. I'll let, her, I'll let her gain one more level, and then I'll uh, go for a physical defense. Because, yeah, Lota, of course, being a mage and fragile, her defense kind of sucks. So, yeah, having that matched out later on is really, really helpful. Uh, as far as spells go, let's go ahead and get Revive. Um, definitely want to get Quick. Uh, let's go ahead and grab Spark. The other ones here, like Airscreen, Protect, Rise and Shine, they're not really that good. Uh, I still have the... Uh, Press cap for mage weapon, so we'll just hold off on that for right now. And we'll get aqua, just so we have all of our uh, elemental bases covered there. Um, let's go in and also reload ammo while we're while we're here. And as far as upgrading goes, mm, I'll hold off on hold off on that for right now, actually. Just we're actually going to be uh, free of boss fights for a little while, actually. Although, if you went to the uh, Rayline Observatory first, you'll have some boss fights there. But you actually won't have any if you go to Holst first, which is why I'm gonna go there first, actually. Does the sound just kind of sound weird right there? I don't know if it was just me, it just sounded kind of weird for a second. Maybe I just, I just heard something off somewhere else and it just got me confused. Probably very likely. <laughs> okay, anyway. Back to the Alive Reflector here. <clears throat> now, where do I want to go? Excuse me, by the way, sorry. Uh, let's see, that's the Dragon's Vein, and we have the uh, Ruins Mine. I think this one will lead you to the uh, Observatory, and the other one will lead you to uh, to Holst. So I want to go to uh, Holst first. If I have this right, anyway. I did these ones mixed up all the time, as to which one goes where. But, uh, <laughs> we'll see. If I mess up and get the wrong one, I'll probably just fast-forward backtrack or whatever, because it won't take that long anyway. Well, that'll just help to speed things along anyway. Yeah, right there sounds like dun dun dun. I don't think it's supposed to do that, but I don't know. What do I know? Yeah, like right there. I don't know why the sounds doing that all of a sudden. It never has before until just now. Huh. Well, it's it's nothing. I wouldn't worry about it really. And let's see. We are. We are. In the wrong spot. Son of a bitch. I don't want to go here. Okay, well, actually, I won't use Fast Forward. It won't take that long, just because we can use the uh, red teleporter link anyway. Oh, the other one. Yeah, yeah, okay. So, red is Holst, and yellow is here. I should have figured, you know, Ruins Mine, that is a, they mine them in a, you know, in a mine. That <laughs> that made sense now, actually. I, I'm stupid. You guys knew that already, though. Still going on my recordathon, by the way. This is episode 21 already. This is the, uh... Jeez, like the... Eighth episode I've done today already, actually? I think eight or nine already. 
which is amazing for me. So, and I'll be able, I'll still be able to record like all day tomorrow. Why is the sound crapping out on me right now with that? Like it never did that anywhere else until like just here. It might be the emulator crapping up. I don't know. It, it, it usually runs fine for me for the most part. Huh. Well, I apologize for that, but oh well. There we go. Um. Whoa, 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 whoa. Whoa, what the fuck is going on with the emulator today? Maybe it needs a break, actually. I have been recording for a while. Yeah, I think this will be my last episode for today. I think the emulator needs a break. <laughs> I've been working it too hard, apparently. Anyway, here's Holst. Yeah, the emulator definitely needs a break. Sorry, uh, EPSNC, I've been working you too hard, I apologize. Yeah, like, really long loading times here also. This is ridiculous. Wow. Um, actually... Um, I should... Okay, well, maybe I can, uh... Okay, well, I don't have much else to do today, actually, so I'll, I'll make this episode just uh, exploring the town. And won't do much else. Because I don't want to kill the emulator, I don't want it to crash mid-recording. So I'll just save right here, just in case. So, just to be on the safe side. Oh, why did I do that? Oops. Um, okay, let's, uh... Let's <laughs> start up again. Uh, yeah, today's episode is just weird, like, all around. Uh, yeah, I think I'm, I'm due for a break. I, I, I've been recording for the last, like... How many? At least three hours? Yeah. Okay, so. Okay, uh. No, no that's an on file. There we go. Uh. <laughs> Let's just have fun with the episode. Why, why, why stress over it? It's not gonna matter. Okay, there we go. We're back. Boy. Okay, well, I do want to go over here first because... Wait for it. <laughs> Wait for it! Dramatic build-up for bombs! I'm not sure why they're under a bed. That's very dangerous, actually. Okay, well, the emulator seems to be okay for right now. Here's what, here's what I'll do, actually. Let me uh, buy some stuff here, actually, because we have uh, new shops here, by the way, with a new town and whatnot. Uh, let me see here. Yeah, weapon shop, definitely. Oh, that reminds me. Um, crap. Yeah, you notice how we have armor here, but no weapon shop? Um, yeah, the weapons are actually back over in Hallmets. I forgot about that. <laughs> okay, so here's the idea. Um, what I'm going to do... I'll cut the episode right here, actually, and then next episode I'll meet you guys back over in Hallmets to buy some new weapons there, and then I'll transition back over here and then keep exploring the town. Sound good? Sound good. For next time, well, let's play Wild Arms 2. This has been Night on Movie Sign Off, guys. Have a great day, and thank you for watching. Yeah, sorry for the short episode today, but yeah, stuff happened. Y'all saw it, so see ya.